hi guys welcome back to my channel today I thought I'd take you on a mini adventure to one of the local farms they have uh, this tiny vending machine uh, next to the road and I've been there once before when they had a bigger building by the road um, it was still a vending machine at that time but now there's some construction going there's some new um, apartment buildings being built so they've condensed it to really a small little hut um, with the vending machine inside so let's go check it out Okay, so here we are. It's a bit dark, but I hope you can see the vending machine. There's different kinds of products in there. I definitely see the cream cheese, which I saw last time. There's some milk at the very bottom. Um, there's some yummy looking yogurts. And there is a block of cheese, which I have my eye on. So let me make some purchases and then I'm going to go to the store, grab some things to go with the cream cheese, some crackers, and then I'll test them out for you when I get home. I just waved to the farmer who sells these. I can see that there are sheep there behind me in the field, so maybe these milk products are from those sheep. Um, I did notice that all the products in the vending machine are out of sheep's milk. I've never had sheep's milk before that I know of, so let's see how they taste. I didn't get the cheese. Um, it was a rather big block of cheese and considering that I don't know how sheep's milk will taste like I didn't have the courage to um, to try it out yet so let me test out these I got some uh, raspberry yogurt I got some blueberry yogurt and then I got some uh, cream cheese so I'm now on my way to the store I'm gonna try to grab some crackers and then give them a try Okay, so I'm back from my shopping trip and I've set up a little picnic here for myself to try some of the samples. Um, I have to admit that I'm a little bit apprehensive about the sheep's milk because I've never had any. Um, I've tried goat's milk before, I'm not a big fan. I also am not a big fan of uh, goat's cheese, so, so let's see, I don't know why um, sheep's milk would be similar to goat's milk, it's probably not at all. Um, but somehow I'm a little bit apprehensive. I know I'm usually quite open to trying new things. I mean, I've, I've tried snails, I've tried alligator, I've tried bear, um, I've tried all kinds of game because my dad is a hunter and my granddad was a hunter as well. But I don't know, somehow the sheep's milk is, is really um, something that I'm a bit nervous about. I almost, when I walked in and I noticed that all of the products were just made out of sheep's milk, I almost was like, you know what, forget it, I won't do this um, video after all. But then I was like, come on, I mean, it can't be that exotic that I won't even give it a chance. So let's see, I have the yogurt here. I'll start with the um, strawberry yogurt, which should be um, nice and easy. Hopefully it, it'll be good. And then I got some cream cheese, which should also be good. And it says that it's pasteurized. Um, sheep's milk. The only flavoring is um, sea salt, so it sounds good. I usually love cream cheese, so this should be, this should be great. Um, I read online uh, in preparation for trying sheep's milk. I was trying to read kind of what to expect, and they basically said that um, it's very similar to cow's milk, except that it's a little bit sweeter. 
because of the way the fat is um, built into the structure of the milk and because the fat is a little bit different in um, sheep's milk it doesn't need to be um, treated as much as cow's milk um, so let's see I sweetness shouldn't be an issue in yogurt <laughs> so let's see how it tastes Okay, so this is actually really good. If no one told me that this was made out of something other than cow's milk, I wouldn't have guessed. It's really creamy, and you can really taste the strawberry. Mm. It's almost like, uh, in Finland we have quark, which we eat, which is a little bit... Um, I don't know, I want to say sour. This is not sour at all, but a little bit creamier than yogurt, I think. This is it's really nice. I love it. As I said before, I also got the blueberry version, so I think that will be my, my breakfast tomorrow. I will finish this, but first I'm going to give the cheese a try. Smells like regular cream cheese that I've had before. The texture is a bit grainy, I guess. Not as smooth as like, I don't know, Philadelphia or something. It's really good. I almost want to just try a little bit by itself. Yeah, it's good. I don't find any weird taste that I may have been expecting. Definitely worth to buy and I will most likely be buying it again. Um, so I hope you enjoyed my little adventure today. If you have any ideas of what you'd like to see uh, going forward, leave your comments below. Uh, I'm looking forward to hearing from you and getting some ideas. I have plenty of stuff um, planned. Some of it I can't do yet until the restrictions um, are lifted, but there's plenty that I still have planned. Um, it looks like the banana bread uh, baking video was a big hit, so I will definitely have more baking stuff coming for you guys, so stay tuned. Bye.